These black beauty Jefferson nickel coins sold for a lot of money in auction and you might actually have one of these improperly produced coins. So I must say there are other coins that are very similar looking to these quote unquote black beauty coins as collectors call them. Now the way these occur is during the minting process. These are technically called improperly annealed coins. Now improper annealing in coins occurs when the coins are not heated or cooled correctly, resulting in an uneven distribution of internal stresses within the metal. This can cause the coins to be brittle, prone to cracking or breaking, and may affect the overall appearance of the coin. This improper annealing can be caused by a variety of factors such as incorrect temperature or heating time, insufficient cooling time, or variations within the composition of the metal in order to prevent this sort of appearance going on here and to ensure high quality coins there needs to be some strict quality control measures in place but let's hop into this video let's look at this first coin you can tell in the center of the coin it looks very brittle and fragile and the colors of this coin are all over the place i personally think improperly annealed coins are very cool i like the color of them this one was graded and authenticated by pcgs at a mint state 64. as you can see it has an improperly annealed planchet and that's why this one the little jefferson nickel sold for $69. Same thing here. Now, a lot of the time, Annex, the grading company that graded this coin, is a relatively good option when it comes to these sort of error coins. As you can see, they have the quotes black beauty on this coin because of the overall color and appearance of the coin. This Jefferson nickel sold in auction for $119. Same thing here. We have a 1959 five cent Jefferson nickel that was struck on an improperly annealed planchet. That's right. So you have to understand that when they are producing, these coins, the planchets that the coins are struck on is where the issue is coming from. Not after the coins are produced, but before when it is the blank piece of metal. Now this one got the mint error grade of a mint state, 65 because it had an improperly annealed planchet and this coin sold for $322. The coin and currency mastermind class community is now live. Click the link below for more information and I'll see you inside.